God bless you, everyone, everywhere. This is the day that the Lord has made, and I shall rejoice and be glad in it. I just need to tell somebody that you were created to create. Listen, you were created to create. Now you've got to get up and use your gift. Now you've got to begin to go forth like never before. Everything that God has anointed or gifted you to do, the Lord is saying move in it, operate in it, so that you can begin to inherit your promise, possess the land. You were created to do this. If God, in fact, in Genesis chapter 1, could see something that was without form and void. In other words, he saw nothing. There was nothing but darkness all over the face of the earth. He began to call and create. He began to call and create. He said, let there be. There was. He began to, my God, green up the grass and the grass be became green. Whatever you do today, begin to create, begin to speak those things that be not as though they were and you will see the for, in for instance of your promise come to pass. I declare it's going to happen. I declare it's going to come forth. You can't miss this move of God. You were created. You were anointed and appointed to do, to do this. Move in your anointing and watch what the power of God is going to do. The Spirit of God has already been released upon you to operate, to be free. Oh my God, to move in it, to, to, to create, to do it. Just do it. You've got to do something. Get up off your seat of do nothing. Aren't you tired of seeing life go by? Aren't you tired of seeing things, amen, pass you by? Aren't you tired of dying in the place that you are in? This is your time. You were created to create. Now get busy. Do something. Use your gift and watch. My God, life come to what you thought was dead. God bless you. I love you. Visit my website at www.terrymcclainministries.org. Listen, share this video because somebody needs some kind of encouragement to get up and do something with what God has given to you. God bless you.